Now we demand the toilet. Man, 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 man. Now, now we demand. Now we demand the kitchen. Later, I'll come back home. So, how am I? Oh, how am I? Oh, I'm not going to be a parent. Huh? Exactly. Okay, please. Nyaro makata. Oh, na. Lenga vana usuta utasa sinto ya kufanya singi ni wula utasa timunte mto na kufanya singi ni wula. And now, but I'm not going and, 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 like that just doesn't make sense. Hi, sippers. Welcome to another episode of Talk Entertainment and Art. You know it's season four, so you know that we are bringing you nothing but content on content on content. It is a new year, but we are still the same, just bringing a little twist, small Nyana twist. To the returning viewers, thank you so, so much for your loyalty. We thank you so much for your support. And if you're new, Welcome. Do remember to share, like, subscribe, and comment. And comment. We're actually planning on something, Yana. We just might interact with you guys on a live chat. We'll see. When it happens, you'll know. So remember to keep on the lookout for any of our posters for new episodes. And remember to engage with us on the live chat as well. As soon as it happens, we will definitely let you know. We have a very, very special guest. We have... Verifinim Gomezulu, who will introduce himself further. He is a podcaster. We will talk about his experience in podcast, in music, and in in he's just everything in the entertainment industry. Welcome, Verifinim. San Bonan. Unjan. Yeah, things you wanted to say. Uh, <laughs> they're bringing you nothing but the best. And that <clears throat> is the best. Yeah, well, so, <laughs> uh, so, oh, introductions. Uh, San Bonan. Mm -hmm. Gomezulu. Uh, like she said, podcaster, uh, I do music, um, what else I do, uh, talent, advocate uh, for a lot of things. Yes. <laughs> uh, talent, uh, uh, manager, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, basically, um, all rounder. Like someone said, you can just do everything, yeah, a little bit of everything. Basically, I'm just trying to push mm -hmm. the industry. Uh, not us, because sometimes business arts, um, like the music and and stuff. Yeah. yeah, I think the very first question I have for you is, how does it feel being on the other side <laughs> of the podcast? <laughs> how does that feel for it you? Feels weird. <laughs> <laughs> it feels weird. It feels weird. I don't know, man. It's, it's it's it's. I've always, I've always, I've always wanted to. because mm -hmm. I'm always stressing on. My questions and yada yada. If you're gonna get it right, if I'm going to get it right, and sometimes if I'm not going to offend the other person, if I'm going to say it right, yeah, yeah. And now someone else is worrying about that. Yeah, that is me and my questions are just like, do I remember? And I'm just chill, I'm relaxed. Yeah, I'm going to see what she's going to ask me. To them, the one. Lay it on me. Yeah. I think I want to understand what your experience in podcasting has been because you are mm -hmm. the founder of Word is Conversation, right? Yeah. How did it come up to be what it is today? Yo, um, I think uh for me it was mostly trying to beat my fears and 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 yeah, things like that. Because mm -hmm. uh if anybody noticed I start when I speak sometimes. Mm -hmm. So for me I've always wanted to do radio and uh it was a thing of I can't do it because I start when I speak. Yeah. So for me, it was like, nah, uh, smash it. I'm going to do it anyway. You stutter when you speak? <laughs> yeah, sometimes. When I'm nervous. When and, you're nervous, okay. Yeah, when I'm nervous. And, All right. And, yeah, when I'm nervous. And when 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 I'm pissed, I, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, when I, I think it happens when I'm thinking, because I think my mind, it processes are fast. Mm -hmm. And my lips are slow. So when I'm trying to say this and something else is in my head and then, and then I'm cutting, it's yeah, just, it's just like, like a shy sound. So I uh -huh. and then I start to, and then I get frustrated. Then I stutter more <laughs> and then I get pissed and then I stutter yeah, well, more and I just keep quiet. And then, <laughs> but that's sort of, but, uh, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. So it, it, it was that. And then mm -hmm. I think it was the 85 South show. 
uh, I watched it and I was like, yo, this thing is funny. Mm-hmm. And yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even know it was podcast or whatever. So when we started, I, I didn't even know we'll see, then podcasts were considered audio. Yeah. Yeah. So for me, podcast, that was my introduction to podcasting. So I saw that and like, yo, this is a podcast. So, and then, because um, I don't think, I just do things. I just wake up and do, I don't just process. Just go with it. I don't process. Yeah, well, maybe that's, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's my letdown. I don't know. I just wake <laughs> up and do things. Yeah. So I woke up and and also I think it comes from a very painful place because I think uh, around about let's discuss later. So my dad was ill and died. So oh, put it. He passed on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, and and then he passed on. And then from there, I was like, Ish. I was just. I was like, life is too short and too long to be in a place you're not happy. Before he passed, were you in the process of building something or it's something that happened after his passing? Yeah, you know, when he passed, I was uh, I was working at a um, Ministry of Public Works and Transport. Okay. Yeah. Well, Are you still employed there? No, I left. For the podcast? Yes, I left. Okay, we're going so, to get to that. Yeah, so uh, I, was, I was working there and then uh, for me... It was waking up every day, going to a job where you're like, you're dying. Yeah, well, mm. yeah. People like see you in suits every day, like, ah, it's the one. You're just putting up this. Yeah, well, and, and, and I'm fake smiling every day. And I was like, <laughs> life's too short. Let me just like take a leap. And mm-hmm. then, 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 then. So I did that. And um, I used people around me. So Gnas Balwam, who also produced Slim Q, mm-hmm. one of. Uh, my producers like mm-hmm. uh, he was uh, I think uh, the first groups like to ever do music yeah. uh, stealth independence oh, I know you know that but anyway uh, stealth independence oh, do we do? <laughs> don't understand it's estimate us <laughs> yeah, yeah stealth independence <laughs> uh, they did both groups but was one of the f- uh, not one of the first group to ever rap in Siswati in the kingdom really? first to ever do like Siswati music, yeah. Well, rap wise in the kingdom, those are the first. So, so I, cause the Nabea Konak shooter, I was in the sound. Mm-hmm. Then I couldn't handle camera. I couldn't do any of the things I say I do today. Mm-hmm. So yeah, so he came on board, and there's another uh, uh, brother in law of mine, brother of a brother in law. So, yeah, so, like, your family is just into the industry. Yeah, it's a pop. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, so, yeah, so I brought him on because we uh, we used to argue about music and, and, and so yeah. I was like, okay, cool. Went to shooter and still co-hoster and stuff. Okay. So we did that for a while. And, yeah, it picked up. And we went to the Times and we were like, ah, you're doing podcasts. Like, yeah, how come yours is video? Like, okay, it is the other podcast, <laughs> the one with pictures. But it's just yeah, a podcast. podcast. So we went to the Times and we did that. And yeah, it grew from there because uh, I think for me, the thing I was going to do, I'd have an idea like, yo, let's do internationals. Let's mm-hmm. do this. Let's do this. And we started from like a budget of zero. Yeah, well, zero. We had nothing. nothing. We didn't have a camera. didn't have anything. There were anything. So we started from that budget. And uh, we did like, yeah, but we have like a pretty impressive catalog. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. you've worked with so many international artists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So ours was like, please and thank you. Please and thank you. Please. That was a currency. Mm-hmm. Please. Now I did Now I to thank you. And, yeah. And and with that, I think, yeah, man, you can go like really far because we've made like pretty, pretty, pretty good like relationships mm-hmm. yeah, well, with all these people. Remember, I went to Tamam Kiza's house. He treated me like a son. Like like big 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 artists worked mm-hmm. with Bo Miriam and Makeba and them. Yeah. And then uh the other one, uh Kuri Chana. Uh we we did that. Um <laughs> funny And then story. you also had Aries and Pretty yeah. Ugly endorsing. Yeah, them, 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 them I worked all in 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 then uh hypnotic. Yeah. So yeah, I spoke to Sakita. Sakita was like, Dope, you can come cover the show because we 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 did podcasting and also like cover shows and mm-hmm. and we did that thing that got us in trouble with the artists. Like, uh, we, <laughs> <laughs> What's the thing that got you in uh, trouble? In? Was in the album reviews. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so we tried to like things. So yeah, so yeah, so he said, okay, cool, we can cover the hypnotic thing. So we did that and we met Bonkabo Aries and them like dope people. Apparently, was cool. 
But anyway, uh go no pele go scoop. What did scoop do to you? I scoop I I dug dug I scoop 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 and come out say I'm not but Jerry he wasn't like the person yeah well you yeah. actually speak to cuz he was being like casting a lot and and then it was him. I think he caught feelings with he wanted to speak to Casper and him. Yeah. Everyone was like then it, it was a whole was other thing. And he was just in your way. Yeah, it was all other thing. Yeah, well. But <laughs> but anyway. But do yeah. you feel like actually having your family um as a part of the entertainment industry mm-hmm. gave you that faith to take the leap that you did nah. from leaving a stable job? No, nah, not really. I think I think for me it was I I think for me it's a thing of always trying to do something different like challenging myself like this like l- like the starting thing i'm doing right now mm-hmm. uh was a thing of um i can't do this because of this let yeah. me do it anyway yeah type thing so yeah and also i can't do it because i have a budget of zero mm-hmm. but let me do it anyway you know yeah god providing so Amen. yeah what that thing if we keep listening to uh Kirk Franklin he tells us good see he will supply and yeah. then you don't do and then now <laughs> you keep blaming god and say ah uh, but when you didn't but, do this but you didn't do this but it, it is you who did not do it so i'm like <laughs> so yeah. you, did, what are the fear apart from cuz you did say that starting a podcast came from mm. a place of wanting to face your fear of yeah. stuttering did you do you feel like the fear of leaving a secure job was mm. greater than the fear of stuttering and things like that Yeah, I think so because if you are going to leave a stable job plus uh, you are a father like me and then you're like, "Eh." Like that yeah. is a big leap of faith. Yeah, that's a big leap of faith, but also going back to family. My family is like strong, 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 strong support system. Mm-hmm. So they're like, "Okay, cool." Because my spare has this um uh has an advertising agency. Mm-hmm. So it's like, "I see what you're doing. I really really like what you're doing. Come to speak. Let's try and see what we can do." Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, see what you do and see what I do how we can merge the two and then and so that's where you started so now uh yeah it came to be what it is yeah, now yeah i never really and I, i never really liked but know, also cuz i could see your posts on instagram mm. where does conversation always gave out optimistic quotes and things like that yeah it came from the fact that you saw where optimism got you yeah i think also also i think i'm a person that uh i i try to push the p <laughs> yeah, I still don't know what pushing the P is. Can someone please pushing bring me up to date, well, guys? I'm yo, so listen, lost. Listen, listen. All I've been seeing is the emoji. Look, 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 the like, uh, forgive yo. me. <laughs> Lego, please. <laughs> I'm constantly pushing the P. Positivity. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. Thank so you. I think I think I I'm not the man. Uh, it's 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 not even sometimes it's not even conscious. I think the things you go through. As to the OZ, mm-hmm. it's in most snowflakes, but yeah. So, guys, go busy. I'm like, we're not in our usual shooting site. Yeah. It is just yeah. So, so yeah, man. So b- b- pushing the P, months, yeah, pushing the P. Yeah, I think it's not even a uh, conscious thing. It's like going through things and trying to look at them from a different perspective. Yeah, yeah. Well, because sometimes uh, people are like, um, people like staying in the mud. Mm-hmm. You know, when when things happen, people like to stay here and complain. Mm-hmm. Like, yo, it's like this, that, 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 that. And not want to make it off. change. Yeah. And for me, I feel like I have no other option. Whatever I do needs to land, needs to land, yeah. needs to land. If it doesn't land, I need to see why it did not land. Mm-hmm. So I guess the positive calls come from there. Good see. If this did not land, so what other looks And then I start telling myself in my head and then I maybe put it down mm-hmm. yeah, well, maybe it comes from the i don't know but i just try to be like positive yeah well, i try and you try. knew that you literally had no other option but to be positive because yeah. you took this giant leap of faith yeah and you had to make sure it works out mm-hmm. yeah well because if you're negative then you are sitting down if you're positive then you're doing something and there's also they, the law of attraction as the well. law of attraction exactly mm-hmm. yeah, well, like every i was telling one way Mango was saying some other rapper has an ego, and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, give me one rapper, that successful rapper that does not have an ego. You need that ego. 
you need to tell yourself because another thing that happens, people want you to be passive and uh and then they want you to say, Ah yes, I'm a boy. And they want you to say, Ah yes, I'm a boy. Instead of yeah, boy, you say um when you have money, say yes, I do have money. When you when you when you're good at making a mati pot, I am good at making mati pots. You need that. You need that ego. You need to. You need to affirm yourself. But then, I mean, like, in the place that we live mm. in, the way that we grew up, the minute I have an ego, I would say, no, guys, mm. people are going to feel like I'm patting myself too much on the back, and then they'll want to prove to me that listen. Baby girl, it's not how you think it is. We're not going to buy your teacups. Okay, the truth is, whether you pat yourself on the back or not, people are still going to speak. So, you favor not and that I want to pat yourself on the back every day. Look yourself in the mirror and say, "You are the one. I, I'm the one. I'm enough. I can do this." Mm-hmm. Because no one, no one, no one besides you is going to make you feel confident. Yeah, enough. we are but our own greatest exactly. cheerleaders. Yeah, but like, so tell yourself every day, "I am the one." The one that they don't yes. think I am, I am that one. Yes, I am the one. Because <laughs> good, 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 and bamba. Because we are so maybe society. I don't know. We are so people like to put us in boxes. That's you know, true. In boxes, we're still okay, cool. Um, where now? Oh, hamukunala. Oh, hamukunala. Where now? Hamukunala. Mm. It's that, and then you start assuming the role. Of the ones who say, "Oh, well, I mean, this is who I am. This is what I am." That's true. That yeah, is well, very true. Yeah. Exactly. So. Take yourself out of the box. No one's going to take you out of the box except you. Take yourself out of the box. Things like things are not going to work out. Things are going to work out. That's just life. Okay. Like, I mean, we always say that yeah, it's saying it's going mm-hmm. to work out, it's not going to work out, it's just life. But then I feel like it's easier said when you are on the other side of life. What other side of life? What, like what when things are going about? grand, like everything is fine. Yeah, but it's easier t- for you to tell me that no, it's too long. No, things are not going grand. The thing is, uh, we never know what the other person is going through. That's true. Yeah, but you just assume. We'll say, oh, things for you are grand. That's why you're saying, yada, 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 yada. No, That's true. Maybe that's speaking uh, from a place of, we'll say, maybe I'm going through some, 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 yeah, some other thing now, but I can give you that. Yeah, well, this is what I yeah, learned from that. Exactly that chat could say, okay. Um Ganjal, 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 Ganjal. But it's like it's like saying it's it's like someone saying, I figured myself out. You you we can never, never really, fully figure exactly, yourself out. We never out. get there. Yeah, because we're constantly evolving. Exactly. We always wanting, we always yeah, well, that's mm. just human nature. Yeah, well, that's true. Yeah, well, so yeah. So. Like on the chat of as being put in a box and being told that this is how far you can go. Mm. As a music producer, have you seen that happening in with local artists? Yeah, how? In the sense that, do you feel like they always, they may feel like, you know what, I have this potential, mm. but because of the country that I live in, I can only go as far as this. Have yeah. you seen them then box in their potential and just live where they're told to live? Uh. Yeah, speaking, it's a lot with that. Like, like it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot of chats. I know. Yes, number one in logo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, no number one in logo. That it happens. Yeah. Well. What do you I, mean? And what, what's going on? Yeah. So number one in logo. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, uh, people are put in boxes. Jan 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 jan. Number two, the thing about uh, artists, la uh you can sell your product. I think, where do I begin? I think we start from, um, if you do not know the music business, whether you're put in a box or not put in the box, it's going to be a problem. And now, uh, yesterday's begin for you, see, uh, um, um, the consumer base, um, 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 music when you go have in Jan Jan pop, Jan Jan pop quality. But now we have the quality. Mm-hmm. Now we have um the quality. We have the product now. Mm-hmm. We need to sell the product now. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so now what we do not have Nyaro is the business aspect of the music business. Mm-hmm. We have the music. We do not have the business. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so that's why I was telling guys earlier. You see, I mean, if you come to me and say. I do not care. 
I do not care because <laughs> <laughs> But it's my song. And yeah, it's I do nice. Not care. <laughs> Please L- listen to my nice song. I don't care how nice the song <laughs> is. We are the only people that are still competing I in my in in. People are competing with numbers. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. Exactly. So come to me and say, uh, Ingo Miami, it thinks that this much. Ingo Miami has this kind of numbers. Okay, but on, in the country, because like that doesn't happen much. Is there some kind of compromise? Good see, maybe my song is nice, but the people are just not recognizing compromise, it. Uh, compromise will not buy you bread. But my song is nice. Yeah, but just can you try and make sure that it buys me bread? But your nice song will not buy you bread. But the people are not seeing my nice song. Can you make the people see my nice song? Who? Me? But, Mosuena, don't you know the people in her place? <laughs> <laughs> That's the other thing. I'm yeah. only one person. Mm. And also for me to help you, you need to be a person. Do, 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 do yeah. Uh, I've managed like two artists. Mm-hmm. I'm on my third. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The two artists I have managed it was a thing of um uh in for uh maybe we want this thing to be like a two minute noodle thing yeah yeah well, and like a microwave career like, like, like a microwave type thing and also it wasn't a thing of uh as funze guy guy because kwananami i was i was i was i was fairly new in the game yeah yeah well, so now i was trying to figure things out mm-hmm. but at least i had lelos and sana would say we are still learning Mm-hmm. But still, mm-hmm. so the thing about artists, I I saw an interview um by interview request on Mechi, and he said um he never wanted to 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 do the business side of things. Yeah, he only wanted to be in studio and psh, yeah, well, yeah. So if that happens, you do not understand anything. So you are quick to say so and so dochi. You are quick. You to need say, to pick up every part of it. Exactly. You, you are quick to say. Uh, and then you you part ways with people. So I'll sit there now, show us in the way. Now I'll find a good seat. Do you understand? Mm, and you don't even understand the full aspect of the business. Exactly. So you need to understand. We don't have the business now, mm-hmm. and also the environment we're in does not allow. People keep saying, uh, "Waffles." Uh, she she was doing the same thing Langwane, and then Wahamba Oi Popa in SA for Langwane. People do not uh, support. My thing is. Swaziland, I will come because the industry here to yaga entertainment. Yeah, it's not. Do you even have an industry? I do not know, but it's not. I, I, honestly, I also want to call it like full industry. It's, yeah, well, it's just there. Yeah, well, because you 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 need media. You need in in. You need mm. in in. And our media cannot make you famous because it, it reaches your corner. Ang ay corner looks and for you to to be famous, it's not the work that you do. Mm. It's the marketing that you do. That's true. Yeah, well, and. Largely, it's to go media it, and I'm going to go there here because it reaches like CEO Lenganan. Business wise, if you want to do business, la la angwa ne upageti tina njanjanyan, it makes sense. You can pop up with the paper and njanjanyan, but if you want to do music, if you want to pop up somewhere else, again, okay, that's how it, that's how it happened. Our folks, because my paper on the Sunday times and Sunday in in their reach is wide. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, so it makes sense. So knowing that. Our country, in the the music mm. industry part mm. of it, is quite limiting. What is it that you feel artists in the country can take from what happened to Waffles? Because I leave. feel like honestly, she is the biggest thing that has ever happened in this country. Leave. Go, go, leave, go, <laughs> Hamba. go, <laughs> Hamba. <laughs> go. You feel like that's the best thing that they can do. I'm about to get that, but <laughs> but I'm glad. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. But I think, I think, I think, go, 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 I too. If you're going mm-hmm. to, uh, be in the industry, Ube like uh, Sisonke, mm-hmm. I don't think without Popagat because I don't think we're there yet. Yeah. But if you're going to say, um, this is my business, it's I see me myself and my craft. As, uh, exactly. I see myself as a business. And whatever music I drop is a product. Mm-hmm. So if this is a product, it's like tamati is nakring trap. Yeah, well, I need to sample my market. I need to uh melanga to go see in things alaban. Yeah, well, uh also my marketing when I speak to these kind of people, melang kulme na bogan jan. Don't like just like any other product, just like any other business. Yeah, well, 
because if you do that uh, no, if you want slow, you can't change anything. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's why I was saying we're the only people that still compete in in Goma mm. This is a product. You that's need to true. sell the product. The matter is, well, we are not able to do it. Same with music. You're going to record five, five, can't even name five albums. About two hundred. And they've been working. Been, yeah. Well, now you burned out. Yeah, well, and you now don't have, have feel, motivation. Exactly. That feeling was okay, cool. Mbuya sito looks and sign a source band. Yeah. Burnout. All your creative and your 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 hit song. Why end up in album? You have to get And you don't even know what that feels like anymore. Exactly. Now, ute ute. Baba sebab exam niya ute hit song. Yeah, well, because you keep dropping things on SoundCloud, and I'm not saying people shouldn't drop things on SoundCloud. English is like actually my language. What I'm saying is. <laughs> Yeah, well, make sure yeah, we're in a different area. Like, make sure, make sure, make sure, make sure you couple your music with the business so it becomes yeah. the music business. It makes sense. It makes a whole lot of sense. Yeah, well, all I'm saying, like, couple the two. Yeah, well, we're going to be very enjoying it. Do you feel like um, not affiliating with this conversation with mm. any known stable in the country was the best decision you made? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or do but, you feel like maybe you but, could have been taken to greater heights had you done that? No, I don't feel that way because uh, being so long time as like, like, like a superstar, like, and, like even a mega star, like mm-hmm. yeah, well, what's happening with Buffalo? Like yeah. I'm very, very happy. Yeah, well, and I feel like La like, and we still don't have. Uh, okay, man. Oh, oh, like like an example who could <laughs> would have like merged with like an example maybe you being under Swazi boy I, but okay so <laughs> so so I no angkaba ganjal but mm-hmm. I feel like uh because the introduction sort of you should see we do not have institutions mm-hmm. yeah, well, the reason why uh. South Africa is winning. They have the same problems that you you the 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 less now. Mm-hmm. But at least But at least one my institutions are but they make sense. Yeah. They make sense. They have institution good see okay. Um Lana go uh Ingoma Nitro Pega Kalawa at twelve. Mm. Lam na half as twelve, that was a snail long one. It's the it's the service sea ladder. It ever say hit. Ungoma le tropela le alangwa na half twelve. Eh, kamanzin lamba wa nita fe next month. Yabo. That is a big problem. Our marketing, uh, it, we don't have institutions that make sense. Yeah, we makes don't sense. have institutions that make sense. So if we, us in South Boy, mm-hmm. could collectively come and say, okay, cool. Ah, uh, nin 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 da in um slamb in antidote or in in. Mm-hmm. Yabo. And go go ngai then for you because right now what's happening is city cool to kakun and smangla ne kakun. Yeah, we're dividing the market. Mm-hmm. And in yalo, I feel like we're going to see an amine. I feel like we're going to see an amine. I feel like we're going to see an amine. I feel like we're going to see We all want to say, I did that. I did that. That's in, true. Instead of like a collective, smangla ne kakun. We all did that. Exactly. Instead of a collective, we say, okay, cool. Um, slamble for. Half a year, it's push out through my artists mm-hmm. as a collective. Yeah, it's push out through my artists because we can all eat from that cake. Mm-hmm. About it's push out through my artists for the next six months. So long as they are our creative things, go and up your And it just works together. And after three months, uh, Cecilia Miegel or whoever uh is signed to so so you have also to be and then the next three months. Push it other three artists. Ganjaro mm-hmm. Anjalo. Masika Kunakti Hambera Lumtana Low S M Ps Kulul. Ganjaro Anjalo. Yeah well. So I think it could be a thing because Bangana are called if you divide mm-hmm. the markets like what happened uh, at the Casper show. Uh there was a lot because was a big artist. Big, 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 big artist. But he came, uh the numbers did not reflect. Mm-hmm. Because was Linda Mane and there were four other shows happening at the same, same time. time. So they divided the market. Kabese, ebo. Kanzi, kube these three other people, but it's a festival. Mm. 
Mhm. Dabona kasi tabe na dorumunya begeta. The numbers would have actually the shown. The numbers would have. Yeah, well, and everybody we were told from that cake. Mm. Thing is we want to eat the whole cake. That's true. Yeah, well, and Augustus and Thou. Yeah, well. And it's that I feel like a lot ankabangu to back abanga jal. But I don't know. Yeah, well, so I don't yeah. think they're actually looking at that side of the picture. Yeah, because yeah, there's a lot, there's a lot, there's a lot, there's a lot uh, going on. Mm-hmm. Uh, living, it's like COVID. When COVID hit, it really exposed us to a lot of things. Mm-hmm. A lot of things. It exposed us. Cause see, uh, the industry that we say we have, it was evil, evil, fire, fire. <laughs> 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 I'm <laughs> telling you guys, like, got to say green and lana. It really, it really exposes. Cause see, uh, it really was an industry of, um, the humbling a studio, mm. record a song, and then best thing tell her, oh, um, God, no, I'm not gonna show you humbling a gig. People thought that's where the money comes from. That's yeah, well, true. Exactly. And after COVID, as we won't come to a car, car net phone, you need sanitizer, car, lana the car. Uh, and then now people are forced to look at like other revenues for streaming. Now you mm-hmm. won't get in for the, which were things that were very big about Yeah. Now you need to look at streaming. Now you won't get in for the, and now you realize, good see, there's actually royalties. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, people need to, now that's why we're going to sign a good recorder, but remember the business part of it now. Yeah. Better. And now it's uh, split sheets and, uh, uh submitting a song gong 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 because i tell you 90% of my artists langwane do not know where to get their money yeah. but they are quick to say good demandi how can you say good demandi cuz you do not know where where you, you collect that's true good to very sharp but do not say good demandi cuz i want to what to see it yeah boy kula go be tholakala go be bona yeah all you know is i'm going to kick past via covid so say kick why are you eating now? Tell us. Tell us. Where are you getting your money? But anyway, yeah. yeah. But what? I feel like your insight is different. You don't sound calm. It is well. quite different. And I feel like a lot of artists could really take a lot mm. from you. As a producer and as someone who's actually been in the industry for a while. And it hasn't been that long. But anyway. But you've, you've done well. I mean, yeah. there's so much that they can learn from you because clearly you have learned a lot with your time in the industry. Yeah, because that's another thing. Yeah, well, we see, it is a very volatile thing. Anyway, volatile it, it, means like empty, right? Something uh, vague. Vague, okay. exactly, huh? I should come and I can show you the boy. And and liquid <laughs> and liquid industry, you see. Yeah. Good day long fear when it's like I see a lim coin yado. Yeah, that's why I love lim cooking. I see a lim coin yado, they but one of my classes like music, they study music in Jan Jan. That was that is going to really help. Yeah, well, we see, um you can find this information. There's not like one place we'll see I will find the information. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, so if you take the time and actually YouTube a lot of YouTube videos, like mm. YouTube, uh, because you literally can find anything and everything like anything, on YouTube. Like YouTube, because I mean, I sh- YouTube can literally teach you how to build a house. Exactly, because I mean, on I sh- your phone. Phones are ish. Sounds like a. Oh, banning the phone and the phones. But that's the other thing. Yeah, well, let's see. Uh, we we. Uh, the phones are what's up with that? I'm sure it's one of our phones, but the phones are what's up with that. So if you don't read. You're considered as a stamp. That's true. You know, so if you don't read when, oh, like it's been years. Like, you know, because there's a point where I thought uh, I'm a reader. Well, mm-hmm. Then every time, you realize I read, that, no. every time I read a book, I sleep. Right? <laughs> and you realize, <laughs> like, no, this nah, is the, I'm not this. Not for me. <laughs> I, I think I'm a visual person. Mm-hmm. Well, so everything, we're like, born and listen to it. And, yeah. And yeah, well, for me to learn. And I think if we, yeah, well, in our kids could, Yabo yeah, well, could instill that because thing they and they are called it's like I have a friend, yeah. I had oh, he's still my friend. <laughs> I have a friend, got from two. My friend could 
tractor engine and motor you better pass and people say be said at form two because cargo war they were mechanics yeah no, but, so he saw them do this exactly but in class i being born next yeah, but, but uh big push on them i would say he's dumb mm-hmm. he's dumb i can see what's smart in jan 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 i'm like that's a shyly pass yeah you're thinking about it now like how because this guy would do something i'd never do he's mm-hmm. smart he's smart if uh but talbak and normal society or whatever but that's a log and nature that yeah, well, he could yeah. have like a business now he could have like a in like things like that mode uh, garage like, like a dealership a dick, dick, yeah, well, yeah garage yeah garage how you know garage how you know garage yeah would think that motor looks at motor he could have like a business could be earning a living could mm-hmm. be raising his kids but now because they are sort of push out the hamba or pass english hamba or pass in ini njan 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 and now it messed up his life because in his head when still a good thing and i got smart so he's that's true he's always passive now i figure when i feel i'm going to low low who cannot do nothing with his hands i figure to go yeah good morning i'd say now i should be there say please give me to run excuse me ma'am excuse me please give me to run because he could be doing like a lot yeah but so i'm going to say People are afraid to get uh, information because the way information is not what society deems smart and you can enter there and jan 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 jan. So, yeah, I had no thing. I don't know if you have a But it's feeling. I don't know if you have a feeling. But, yeah, so, yeah, okay. But question, and, question, and question. <laughs> Let me let you do your job. And ask me questions. Like, that is me. why I had. It oh, was very right. interesting for me when I came to hear that I'll be interviewing a podcast. I was like, yeah. huh, <laughs> "This is going to be fun. It's not really going to be an interview. It'll just be another episode yeah, because so, it's two podcasters doing the exact so same yeah, thing." So yeah, so let me do. You, man, ask my questions. I'll call you to your job now. <laughs> too, yeah. I think the very uh, last question that I have for you mm-hmm. is. With the rising podcasts that are here in the country, including mm. us, what mm. would be your biggest, or rather, what would be your advice to those podcasters? Yeah. Like I'm happy, I'm happy with the wave because I feel like I'm, I feel, I feel like I'm the granddaddy. <laughs> I feel like I feel like I'm the daddy, and everyone says my kids. Yeah, and stuff. yeah. I'm I'm really really happy because when it started, you know, it was a thing of it wasn't really a thing of our uh, nothing. Uh, show we wanted to pop, mm-hmm. but it was a thing of because it was very difficult. Because most time people were even saying, "How oh, do you know about YouTube? Yeah, my YouTube was in Why? Mm-hmm. Excuse me. Why is this online? Hambofaga ka EPI, hambofaga ka Swazi TV or yeah. You know the thing of now nah, because we are trying to grow this wave, mm-hmm. and also if like we'd call in Kumbiaban to start podcast, uh, I think then in the in open word podcast. I think it's open word. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but when 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 drop us, yeah, but I was like, yeah, I was really happy because there's a car because we want like as many people to get on this wagon. Yeah, but blah 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 blah. So so the enablers, bo 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 MTN, bo Swaz Mobile, yeah, and so they will see because MTN has it looks like a YouTube bundle. Yes, but they're not pushing it. True. Yeah, but but they're not pushing it. Yeah, well, so my sister Ning and they see us. That actually sense love because everything we are quick to, to 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 say ah, uh, bent up a supporty, mm. jan 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 jan, but we fail to understand what everything's business. That's true. If you show value, then but that was about oh, okay, cool. So my sister Ning, she shows okay, sharp. It's my podcast lang one. It's like I'm fifteen, mm. and they're all trying to rake numbers. Yeah. So they see us okay, love for this value. Mm. And now they push, and now they give us, uh, they give our consumers like deals. Well, if you watch uh, the thirty-five podcast, yeah, open word, whatever podcast, uh, get saying at twenty-five cent and get in it. Now, mm. yeah, well, see, now you have deals because that now this makes sense. Yeah, well, because now this business there, because now there's value there, type thing, type thing. Same I hope with, someone from MTN is watching this. Yeah, and same. like. It's just and, guys, we are available on Instagram. Yeah. You can like contact us. You can DM us. These things we can do. I'm saying, give me money and free a time. 
<laughs> or things. Maybe the yellow T-shirts. <laughs> yeah, we need a rocket. pijama. Our like, rockets. I, I need yeah, a new or, pijama. Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's similar to uh, artists saying uh, the chat you could see. Bantu bala angwa ne aba 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 ba supporti. Yeah. Janja yana doke chumba supporter. Bantu bala South Africa and janja blah 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 blah. And I'm like, eh. Show value. Yeah, well, yeah. Market your product. Yeah, well, marketing and PR are very, very important. Very important. Yeah, well, after you've made your logs on your sana, your your uh in your product, your music, mm-hmm. whatever, market it. Know who to talk to. Mm-hmm. Market it. So it's very important to have a team. It's very into, it's, it's very, very important to have a well manager about phone and arts. Yes. <laughs> yeah, well, managers and uh like like a whole team because mm-hmm. you need a videographer you need your photographer you need uh your marketing person you need a pr person you need mm-hmm. um your manager to oversee your road manager in, in like a mm-hmm. team yeah. you know, want to start formalizing the passion and make it a business you know, and stop moving like the rest you know, mm-hmm. making this like a business you are going to it's going to make sense because lapo you know we'll see every day of the week just like any other job from 8 to 10 to 5 I need to put something in this instead That's of true. on the weekends and jan 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 jan. Mm. Well, now you need to, you have people you need to pay. It needs to make sense. Mm. Now it's the music and other streams of revenue. Because yeah. right now, uh, advocating for different streams of revenue, <laughs> multiple streams of revenue. Mm. Yes. It's very important. Yep. Yep. Is that, you look like you're actually going to continue. Oh, but when I was a song, I was going say, <laughs> no, clearly a lot goes on in your head <laughs> and then also it just <laughs> collides <laughs> ah, you go on and on <laughs> oh, so. Can see, I'm here actually very attentive <laughs> yeah, because so, so yeah so multiple streams of revenue mm-hmm. you know, like I try and have like multiple streams because you know, mm-hmm. you know, internet now you know, we can do a lot that's true so, so yeah a lot can be done video on the internet exactly so. and i feel like there's so much anyone and everyone can take mm. from this episode there's just been so much advice so many opinions so much yep. understanding of the industry as well yep. and i could not be any happier to have you on the show today thank you thank you, thank you so so much for honoring mm. our invitation thank you, thank you. and apologize would we'll see uh, all the questions you had you did not ask them because i just Yeah, well, next time. <laughs> no, but they, they can again. continue and ask them on, on the comment section. Yeah. If anyone wants to know anything, they can say something on the comment section yeah. and we can respond as soon as we can. Don't go, don't go. So <laughs> all, all I'm saying is if you call me next time, I'll let you do your job. And you, you, you are you are <laughs> Definitely. I would appreciate everything. that. <laughs> yeah, you ask everything you want to ask. Yeah, so. Do you want to close, yeah. Mr. Podcaster? No, I mean, I'm grand. I think I should give you the opportunity. Oh, close. Yeah. Ah, yes. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? What are you like? Oh, my God, my back. <laughs>